Hello and welcome to this episode of BMNG Drive. I'm your host David Inark and as you can see we've got a major update. This is now 0.6.00 etc etc. We've got a completely different uh, layout design. Um, I've not even seen it. In fact I was uh, actually going to record something else and this is what I saw. So I want to go ahead and record this and get this out there so you guys can see. Um, this to me is looks very cool. Let's check out, I mean, a garage. <laughs> oh my gosh, what the heck? Navigate the list with the menu up, down, left and right keys. Okay, can always enter the part options with the specified keys. Enter part selection, part sublevel. What the? what the heck okay so you've got this so the frame which i guess okay so let me just uh oh look at the garage that oh that is so cool man <laughs> oh my gosh okay seriously this is cool okay so what if i do this oh nice man okay that's cool all right, so let's look at license plate. That's cool. So you can actually just try different license plates right here. Oh. That. Um, not sure. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Oh, well, it depends on. Yeah, I got to cut the angle just right. Can I zoom in? Oh, yeah, you can using the zoom keys oh my gosh that is so cool okay so let's look at paint dirty <laughs> there you go all right so if i go here ooh, oh yeah okay so they wrap the vehicle selector in here We'll go in here and we'll go in here. So you still have to use the selector. Is there a gloss pure? It's pure black. Flat matte black. I oh, will show this. Oh, look at there. Oh, that did not quite line up. Oh, look at the underneath. That's cool. Not quite line up. So can I actually drive in here? I can rev the engine. <laughs> I don't know what all that means. What's this? Vehicle config save as default vehicle. Oh, that is awesome. So theoretically then, if I save this as the default vehicle, now, supposedly, I'm guessing that means that anytime I start a new level, this is going to be the vehicle that comes up. How cool is that? Okay. So that's the garage. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, oh, I guess I should have showed you uh, in the vehicle selector. They did come up with a new ETKI series. And so, holy cow. So now there is a new car that has been added to the mix. A little four-door sedan jobby here. All right, so let's go back here. All right. Um, so mods. All right, so mods works the same way. All right, it just brings up the mod manager. Back. I, this I like this layout a lot. I, I really didn't think I would. Um, when I first saw it, it's very... I know a lot of people are going to say modern. I'm going to go with, you know, it's the whole flat metro thing, whatever. But I like it. It's actually very clean, very easy to get around. Let me just... So, okay, so the different options here. That's cool. All right, so now if I hit play... Yeah, this is cool. All right, and if we do um, free roam... And, of course, you know me. I'm heading for the uh, ski jump. Oh, and there it is. That is the default car. That is so cool. Oh, look at there. And I also get the default uh, breakdown of pieces, parts, and what have you. All right, so just out of curiosity. Oh, excuse me. 
let's see what happens if we do oh my gosh this is very very cool oh my goodness that's I, I like the fact you can change your default vehicle I mean you know it's a little thing it really is but you know, if you didn't want that truck all the time then you know you could actually pick a vehicle that you'd rather start with each time you fire up a map that is fantastic Oops, I let off the... Oh, yeah. That's a bit of a problem, huh? That's my bad. I let off the uh, gas and stuff. I wasn't really... <laughs> How you doing? Hanging out? Cool. Oh, okay. Well, that's not what I had in mind, but how cool is that? That's actually a neat... Uh... <laughs> okay, here. Oh, yeah. We are, we are hanging out, man. Uh, I, I don't like this, man. I don't like this one bit. All right, well, fine. Then we'll do this. All right, so there you go. Let me get back. Um, huh. Oh, down at the bottom, main menu, instead of the exit key down here. Um, are, is there other stuff? No, nah, that looks all the same, right? Photo mode? Has there always been a photo mode? Probably. Okay, here we go. Sorry about that, folks. I had to figure out what was going on here. So one of the new things that they've added as well is called linking. And with linking, you just basically get close to the trailer. I don't know how close is close, so we'll say there. Well, maybe put a little bit back up here. Oh, well, maybe a little too much. Okay. Let me flip the angle around this way. Well, here, let me do this. See if we can get a little closer here. Oh. Okay, so now you hold L, and while you're holding L, <laughs> the game figures out where the hitch is and automatically will connect the trailer to your vehicle. Okay, that is freaking cool. There we go. Now, am I too far away? I'm so far away from... No, there we go. That is... Oh, that's awesome. I mean, that really is. That is beautiful. I love... I love the whole linkage thing. That is so cool. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, so they've added a very cool feature. And it is... It's its own vehicle. And it is called the dry van trailer. And so we will spawn this. So it's its own trailer. So check this out. You can now take this puppy and meep, 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 meep. All right. So you can do this and get close. And then I should be able to link them up. Oh, hang on, everybody. I should be able to link them up. Unless I'm too far away. I gotta be maybe a little more accurate with this. Okay, how am I supposed to? <laughs> how am I supposed to do this? I can't see what I'm doing. Alright, somehow. Uh, somehow I'm supposed to be able to link these up. Oh, there it is. There it is. I just had to get under it. Oh, oh look at there. Did you see that? The lifts uh, came up automatically once I link them together. All right. I will. Uh, wow, that's way hard to drive this way, though. Yeek. That's a. That's tough to see, man. <laughs> You're going to have to definitely drive off by the side. And I'm not good at that at all. Oh, this is very, very cool. How do you unlink once you've been linked? Hmm. Now that is a good question. Can I L? Yeah. Just hit L and it unlinks. Okay, so now you see how the feet are down? So now if I back up. Oh. Oh no, the feet are down. Oh, you know what? I bet I have to. Did that raise them up? Uh, I could just be in trouble here because of the way the ground is. 
Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right, so now we link them up. Oh, the freaking tree in the way. Okay, watch the feet. Look at that. Oh, that is cool. Holy cow. Oh, and you know why I'm having such a hard time driving? Because I got the parking brake on the trailer. <laughs> oh, that's funny right there. Okay, that is cool. Okay, so one of the things they added is this uh, H-Series ambulance. <laughs> Look, the door popped open. That's funny. Um, but here's the weird thing. If you look at this, right, it's a box vehicle. Okay, now compare that to the picture. This is why I had trouble finding it. That's not what that looks like. That's not what that looks like at all. All right, the only reason why I figured it out is because it had the BeamNG logo, so I know it's official. That's really weird. I, I don't know why... I don't know why they would do that, but this is cool. All right, so what's the... I don't remember what the keys are. Is it J? No, of course it's not J, you doof. It's not H. M. Oh, there we go. Ah, that's cool. Okay, so one of the other things... Um, let's see. I don't know how to do this without... Oh, wait, yes I do. <laughs> Alright, so one of the other things they added, um, excuse me, they added a bullard. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, this is cool. So I can actually do, well this says up and down. But that's not, oh. No. See, that says page up and page down. I'm going to try something. This may break some stuff. Uh, okay. Okay, the problem is it sits <laughs> it sits above the ground. What? What? I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand. How do I, it's not in the right place? Why is it not on the ground? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay. It's because I was on that bridge, I guess. Oh, so you can even set it at different heights. Okay. You know what that means, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see. Let's see what happens if I hit it. Let's see what happens if I can even get close. Let's see if I can even figure out where the freak I put the thing in the road. All right, so we're back here. Go across this bridge here. Oh, I see it. I s no, no, I don't. Um. Uh. <laughs> wait, is this the right way? Yeah, yeah, this is the right. Oh, there it is, right there. Hold on, hold on. Uh, no, 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 no. We can't just go willy-nilly in there, man. We have got stuff to do. Alright, here we go. Oh, sorry, I hit the wrong key. Alright, so I'm going to have to, let's see. I think if we do this, and we're going to have to slow it down. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Looks like a giant mouth. Oh, that's very cool. Okay, so I have another idea. Oh, I don't know where I am. <laughs> that was that was absolutely useless. <laughs> Uh, yeah. yeah, that, 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 that no worky. All right, we're going to try this again. <laughs> we're going to try this again. <laughs> okay. Well, my truck is
Wow. How many times can I epically fail at this? <laughs> Uh, okay, this is that's ridiculous. I cannot believe. Okay, hang on. Oh, that's what I was trying to do. Although, actually, I was trying to get it to go under the van, but that's okay because you know that's not bad for me. <laughs> that's, that's that's actually pretty good. <laughs> oh, okay, that's very cool. I like that a lot. Um, they did another cool thing, and I don't know if I can show you. It may have already been on the screen, um, but they have a bunch of hints and tips that when you're on a loading screen, it, they show up in this top section up here. I'm going to try this and see if you see it. So if I um, go here, and I'm just going to pick, uh, I don't know, Cliff. All right. If this works, then when I hit play, you should see the loading screen with a little hint up top. I don't know what you see here. All right, so I don't know if you got to see it or not. And the way my system records, I don't know if you actually hear me or not. I'll have to go back and listen um, in post, which I know you don't care about. But <laughs> just, these are just some of the things that we do when we're... Uh, uh, editing things and, and going back through, but uh, yeah, the the, the the hint system during loading screens, loading screens, that's very cool. I love the fact that you can set the default vehicle to whatever you want it to be, so it doesn't necessarily have to be the white truck. That that is so cool. Okay, I put in a car, and um, let's see, I need to put in the mod. I mean the app. for AI oh my look at this okay ho ho wait 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 I can't see that see and I got a piece down here I can't see I don't know I don't know why huh well because I didn't have it the right size but I got you I got you okay so I don't know how you set these map targets. Um, I guess I'll have to I'll have to read about that because I'm interested in figuring out how you would set the manual nodes for um, your AI. So that'd be cool. Um, they made a lot of changes in the um, scripting side of things. A lot of changes in the LUA, the Lua, or I don't know how you say that. I don't know what that is all about. But uh, in and in the J beam, um, different different aspects of when you're creating um, maps and when you're incorporating AI, and so they made all kinds of different changes with those as well. Again, that's all in the uh, change log, um, which I think I can uh, put a card to here. Anyway, uh, lots of different changes, lots of cool things. I'm just going to leave this uh, video here. It's just my quick overview of 0 0.6.0 thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time